her name is Abitemi. I hope I got the name right. Did I get it right? Yes, you did. Oh, I did. I got it right. That's her name. And today we have a lot to catch up with. We have some new music here to also share with you right here on Daybreak Hits. Remember, we are live on Facebook as well. So go on Facebook. Check out this beautiful lady and how we're going to speak on music, how we can push music and all that. You know me, I'm all about uh, the girl power, woman power thing. So yeah, yeah, yeah. We're doing this today. Welcome to our studios once again. Thank you, thank you. Uh, can you please tell us a little bit about yourself? All right. Um, good morning, Ghana. <laughs> with your girl, Abitemi, A-B-I-T-E-M-I. Mm. Um, Abitemi is a songwriter, a singer. Um, I'm also, I would say I'm an entertainer. Okay. Yeah, because I can be funny sometimes. <laughs> yes. You do comedy. Yeah. Oh, no, no, no. I don't but do you, you just, you just have that, yes, that little humor. bit about you. Yeah. Okay. All right. That's cool. Yeah. And uh, the name Abitemi, what does it mean? Oh, uh, it's a combination of two names. That's Abi, Abi girl, Temi, and my Yoruba. Name. That's my Yoruba name, Temi oh, Tokwe. Oh, okay, okay, yes. okay. But it's really good. Like I Thank like you. the combination. Thank you. Abi Temi. Thank you. Such a such a beautiful name. Thank you. And how long have you been in the music space? Um, so I started writing. I started music professionally. That was in t- 2019. But okay. I realized I could sing. That was um back in 2017 okay yes okay so i went to a um, couple of competitions like indomie rep my school for kids paradise mm-hmm. and um tv3 was the name um talented kids but i never made it in i, I was able to, i was selected for amazing child mm-hmm. but yeah i didn't continue oh and i also went for vodafone icons yes how many like they, they told me I, I wasn't selected they didn't mention my name at the when they got the list, the list, yeah. But when I left, people started chasing our car to tell us, "Yo, Samini mentioned your name." When I went back, he gave me one big high five, and but I never like continue with the Vodafone icons because oh. I don't know. But you know, it's it's nice because my music journey has been so amazing. Like I can imagine. Yes. I mean, listing all these and with all of it, literally, you couldn't even yes. move a step with it. Yes. Not but even forgetting Kasahari. Like, I'm grateful for where I am right now because now I'm on Hits FM. Yeah. Like, they know I'm coming here. But Kasahari, we'll go and sit at the entrance back on during those Saturdays <laughs> waiting for, like, Pop Skinny uh-huh. to come out and be like, please, I can't I rap, just, I can't I, rap. I just want to come yes. on your show. yes. Hey. I used to rap, so yeah. But what what changed? I you made it in though. Is you that, made it. What changed? You say you used to rap. Yeah, I used to rap. So um, I thought you know music singing is like melodies and easy words. Mm-hmm. Although it's not easy to, but you have to have the voice to start singing. And also sh- my choir, st- like my choir mm. in church. You were in a choir. Yes, I was in choir in church. Okay. So that also helped me. Yes. Wow. This is so beautiful. And you know, now that you've mentioned all these names, like where you have been and I mean, coming on Kasahari, and now you are here on Hits FM, yeah. it's pushing me to now ask you the challenges because when you were going through all of these phases, what was going through your mind? What were you thinking? I was I was like, wow, so is this thing possible? But you know, I'm also like, nah, it is possible. The people that are making it don't have two heads. Mm-hmm. You understand? So I believe I can also make it. The belief changed when I got my first um, foreign collab- uh, collaboration. collaboration. Okay. Yes. Okay. That's um, with Coyote. It got like almost 500,000 streams wow. on Spotify. And I'm so like, it just changed my mind, my mindset. Mm. And also my mindset also changed when I dropped my first song, Why mm. Life. Okay. So I'm like, wow. And I also got verified on Instagram. Yeah. So I'm like, nah. This is something because good. Before the Instagram verification, I was like, wait, these celebrities, where do they, how do they do it? Like, how, you do, mean, they how, get, how do I have, what do I what have do to I do, have do to get, do just to get a very, <laughs> when I write my name, I have to look for something blue on my oh. emoji sticker. I see people do that on my emoji sticker and just put it there so that it looks like I'm verified. Yeah. The day I got verified, come and see, I was in Nigeria. So that was one of the blessings I got from Nigeria. I think last year, by this time, like, I wasn't verified. It was around, um, I think, yeah, July. So this Like, month, literally, like, year. almost like a year now. So, yeah, I'm so happy. Oh, congratulations to you. Thank you thank now, with all those challenges before, I mean, you release your first track, the collaborations and all that, at some point, due to the challenges, did you ever feel like giving up? Definitely. You know, like, it's not easy. 
this is where like sometimes my dad my dad is my support system mm. apart from my team Shantoma records that I just met okay like, my my dad was my support system so this is where you know sometimes parents can be off and on yeah so my dad is like yeah you can do it you can do it but sometimes he's like <sighs> you understand yeah. but he still supports me like so um it hasn't been easy to be honest like you go to places like you go to shows they don't know you you have to beg to say you want to enter just like the kasari thing i spoke mm-hmm, about mm-hmm. so you be there at the show saying please let me perform mm-hmm. one song Same. um i can remember one story you see they do um kokumlemle city night like okay. sala time mm-hmm. yes um i had this person that used to manage me if i'm your man like if you are managing me you're supposed to put me on exactly. <laughs> my own manager is not putting me on Aww. so i used to dance though so with the dance he was putting me on so but when he got to like the music music he wasn't believing because why am i switching up all of a sudden mm. there was a girl called supremo she's a she's a rapper mm. yes like i really appreciate her for what she did that day so when we are inside she ha- she's a rapper so when we are inside she's rehearsing i'm also giving her the the new freestyles that i wrote mm-hmm. so we do it and it was making sense to her so now we, it's like we got our own routine ah. we set our own routine on a beat like our own style on a beat so now it was time for her just to perform like only her mm-hmm. and i was waiting to also perform but i wasn't getting the chance oh. so like it was just her that was supposed to perform and she was like I should come. I should come and i'm stage. like oh. The man is on the stage. Mm-hmm. She was like, nah, I should come. I'm like, bro, how can I come when the yeah. person is... So while she said I should come, the man is like, come, come. No, no, go back. And I'm like, yeah. <laughs> when she said I should come, and it was my cue to come, because I told you we did it together. Yeah, more like so a collaboration. Was, yes, thank you. It was my cue to come in, and I'm like, bro, nah. I just took it, and I went. And then you bust everything out Everything there. bust. Everybody loved us. The next day, even that night, that man couldn't get enough of us. <laughs> the next day, he now t- he now took us to Kokomleme Circle there, to start taking fans with us, and I'm like, mm, I see life. what you did there. <laughs> I see. Yeah. It's life, and it comes with all these challenges. But it sometimes it just goes a long way to tell you how people also feel about it. As you said, if it wasn't Supremo who actually called you on stage, yeah. then maybe nobody would have seen what you got. And it's so beautiful to hear, but. With all of this, as you said, you started 2019, right? Yeah. So from now till, from then till now, how many songs would you say you've released into um, the system? Okay, so I dropped uh, an EP called Just the Beginning. Oh. Yeah, it got like seven songs on it. And also, um, I got a couple of collaborations. But with my, my EP plus the new songs I have, I think that's like um, 10 songs. 10 songs? Yes. That's, that's a good job. Thank it's nice. You. And you write all these songs yourself? Yes, I do. Including the one we just played? Yes. Wow. I do. Do you still dance? Um. So, you know, as an entertainer, you have I would to really be... love to like add, mm. you know, when you're focusing on one thing, you have, like when you're doing mm. something, you have to focus on it. So when I'm, I'm switching up, I'm like fo- focused on it. So... I wouldn't say I dance seriously, mm-hmm. but because of my performance, I want to have Add like a, that yes, to it. I want to yeah. have a big performance, so like mm. I'll start doing that. I think it will go a long way to help you because okay. I, I I think a lot of people love it when you're singing and you're able to dance at the same time on yes. stage. I mean, we've seen the likes of Asha Raymond, we've seen yeah. even our own Mr. Drew from Ghana here. Even those musicians who don't know how to dance very well, but they are able to put their all. I think that it goes a long way to help them. Yeah, me, Aladi and Co. So I think that it would be nice if you add that. Yeah. I would love to see you on stage do that together though. Thank you. Yep. So, I mean, with all of this, with your struggles and everything, I don't know if you also believe in this perception that, uh, like they say that uh, the space does not really favor women. Do you agree with that notion? Hmm. That's a really, really, really good question. Like, mm. that's a really good question. And I think, no, I don't think I agree with you. <laughs> you agree? Why do you say that? Yeah, because um, the male, like they, they believe that the, like male are the ones supposed to do almost everything. Should we say that the the men run the world? You understand? Yeah, in the men's world. Yes, but uh, to me, I you know everybody have different mindsets. My mindset is really good, and I really love it. I I don't really believe that. I I heard a say that says what a man can do, a, a woman, woman can, can do, do better. better. Yes, you understand. Mm-hmm. So <laughs> I have two hands. I have eyes. I have nose. I have leg. 
You understand? Mm -hmm. Although our private parts are different, <laughs> that makes us get different emotions. But yeah, yeah like, mm. I believe I can do what a man can do. Although, like, there are different things that he can do that I can't do. But I can work out. They can work out. I can sing. I have voice. Mm -hmm. You can dance. They the can most equally I, dance. Yes. Mm. And even we have females that are best dancer. Like, that yeah. can even kill men in, in this yeah. dancing thing. True, true. You understand? Mm -hmm. Yes. You will hear some men singing and they sound like a women. female. Yeah. You understand? Like, mm -hmm. I get it. Sometimes get they even book. copy women. <laughs> they copy some of the things we do. Eh? <laughs> they do. <laughs> okay. Interesting. If you're just joining me here on Daybreak, oh, it's. Yes. Mm, okay. My CEO just reminded me what of did something. He say? I hope this lady is listening. I met a female Uber driver. I was so happy. Oh, when? Just when? Um, That was like last week. Okay. Yeah, I was going to the studio and she came to pick me up. I'm like, wow. And she said, um, people judge her. People say, mm. some man said, um, if she, if he knew she was a lady, he, he would have canceled. Have it. Why? And I'm like, why? People some are, sort of sympathy or you understand? pity. Like, sort I of. really don't know. I admire women who do, but it's not even like easy that. to drive. It's not easy. Sometimes to even finish work and you want to drive home is not easy. So if a woman has taken this as a profession, why judge her? Let's support them. If you're just joining us here on Daybreak Hits, my guest this morning is Abitemi. And she is a musician. She's been doing this for a while now. She has quite a number of songs out there. She has an EP as well. And today we're delving more into her world of music and more to come. So if you're just joining us, remember we are live on Facebook. Go on there and be part of the conversation. And also, if you have any questions for her, you can send it via WhatsApp number 0548-841039 and we can have it all up here um doing music i'm sure who would you say you look up to in the space could be nigeria could be ghana mm, that's also another <laughs> interesting question <laughs> yes mm. it is you know the more you grow in the music space mm -hmm. the more you realize that instead of uh, I want to take my time to answer this question. Okay. I really do have people I look up to. Mm -hmm. Let me just go straight to it by saying I look up to um, Kendrick Lamar. Okay. He's a rapper. Very I started good as one. a rapper, but the words mm. is amazing. Okay. I look up to in Ghana. Mm. I love Stone Boy. All right. Okay. Yes. I love Shatale because of his attitude. <laughs> okay. Like, he's real. Mm. Yes, and I in Nigeria, Olami Day. All right. Yes. Okay. That's just Sounds it. really good. I like the way you picked uh, from every industry. I mean, yeah. Nigeria, Ghana, and then uh, it's very necessary. Out there. Very necessary. That's so beautiful to know. And uh, have you met any of them since you started music? Um. So I always have a story about Stone Boy. Okay. So um, I went to Glow Mega Show. Mm. I they did a competition and I won for the ladies. So the Glow Mega Show is for celebrities. But they wanted the up and coming, coming artists one. to have chance. I was back in two, 2018 hmm. or 17. Yeah, 2018. So I was glad I was able to win. I got, I was able to perform. And when Stoneboy was leaving, mm. it was this tight road, yeah. like corner. Okay. And he and his people were coming. I know celebrities, they, they are on their own. So mm -hmm. if you want to do, you to be on your own. Exactly. So I was like trying to pass by me this smallest girl passed by them so they were going i was coming with the people and he saw me and he just stopped me i don't know if he remembers but he, he stopped me he's one who remembers and he, he a stops me and he, he was like it's the same and i was like hey, yeah I yeah him. <laughs> and i was like wow mm. in my head why is stone boy stopping me with all these boys like serious yeah. to me i was minding my business i was hard and also the giddy bar challenge mm -hmm. When I did my 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 own, yeah, he posted it and it was like, "Who is this girl?" Okay, and people were sending it to me. My best friend, you know, when like as an artist, you would want to just wake up to a call where people are like, "This person posted you." Mm -hmm. So that was the time I experienced that feeling. Oh. so my best friend is a Votarian too, and he okay. loves Stone Boy. So he was like, "Yo, Stone Boy posted." I'm like, "Oh me, I've seen it too. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen it before yeah, you." Yeah, that's, that's beautiful to know. But the others, you're yet to meet them. Yes. Oh, and I well, know I'm you. Here them yeah. and i know someday you probably do something with stone boy as well Amen. so you have a new song yes and what's the title ah so hit fm is very lucky because mm -hmm. yeah 
giving you exclusive we listening. we we know yeah. it's a family the that. thing is that uh-huh. we are number one when it comes to that nah, it is we make sure we actually set the pace for others to follow Facts. so the thing is that the music once is out we make sure we are the first to play Facts. so yeah yeah it's happening now it is <laughs> what's the title of the so song the new song is called kana kana um, people ask me what's the meaning of kana mm-hmm. but i think when you listen you can say kana in your own way i was like baby jackana mm. baby jackana so baby jackana jackana means ja means let let okay so it depends on your mood and what you're doing with your baby okay so if you want to kiss your baby you be like baby jackana Ah, baby, so let's baby, kiss. Let's kiss. If you want to, you know, mm. baby, let's do the do. Baby, let's kinda. Okay. You understand? Everything can a- be kinda. Anything can be kinda. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is a brand new one from uh, Abitemi, and of course, I know DJ Bedash has got us on this. Let's take a listen to it, and when we come back, there's more right here on Daybreak It. My guest this morning here is Abitemi. We just listened to one of, should I say, a, a brand new one from her? She calls this one kinda. So as she said, kana could mean anything. Depends on how you want to speak, what language you want. So ja kana anything if you want to yes. say Mr. Agla want us to kana. Hey. Uh, bedash, let's go kana. It Wait. means that we want to go and eat food. Ah, uh, okay. That's all I'm saying. Okay. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for letting me know. So you can be like ja kana. Mm-hmm. Ja ja kana. Ah, uh, so everything kana ja kana. kana you know, okay, yeah. okay, okay. You have to do something so that the person know which kana you're talking about. Exactly. Yeah. I get you. Have you shot a video for it? Mm, so that's like the next thing we are that's about the, to do. Oh, wow, wow. So from now till let's say, I mean, the six months is already gone. Let's say, what are your plans from now till December? Um, I'll be dropping. So this is one of the song of my album. Okay. So I'm so excited about that. The, mm. It hasn't been easy to put it together, but I did it. You okay. understand? Mm. Yeah. Mm. And also, I will be doing a walk. Like, this is something nobody has ever done okay. in the music industry. industry. It's mm. like, I'll be doing a walk from Ghana Vota border to Togo, Aflao border. Yes. And it's like 555 five, five kilometers. Mm. And but why? Why from Togo Togo border <laughs> to that side? Why? <laughs> a flower border to Togo? No. You are, you are saying the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> Accra, Accra, okay. Accra to um, Togo. Togo. Yes. So, but mm. we would stop. Okay. There will be, and the stops will be doing performances. Like, so we we'll stop at Buzia. Mm-hmm. We do some performance. performance. We stop at here. Coco Beat. You know, we, okay. st- we, okay. we do performance just to like connect to the people and also tell them more about like recycling because it's not easy. Like, I see a lot of dirty, hmm. like, we know Except we should well. have a way of recycling our bottles. Mm-hmm. You know, by, you can order. upcycle them. And, you know, there are so many ways. That we can maintain our, like, have a clean environment. Okay. Yes. Even on the water, they write, to keep your environment clean. Mm. So you still buy this thing and put it on the floor. I'm telling you. Uh, it's not, it's, it's not, not good. good. So you have to, like, find the, um, uh, um, a, pas- a plastic that can, not plastic. Um, so if, instead of getting plastic, you can get maybe, um, something like glass okay. that can last mm-hmm. or you can get a recycle, uh, yeah, a something reusable, you can reuse, yeah, something you reusable, can reuse again. um, plastic, so, okay. no plastic, yeah. reusable something that you can, mm-hmm. you know, use again. Yeah. So I'm sure yeah. maybe a bowl you can use, maybe you buy it yes. then after that you can keep it home yes. and actually, you know, store food and right. other things in it. Yes. Something like that. Okay. And, yeah. Sounds really good. As you said, nobody has done it before. I'm yeah. looking forward to see how it will look like. My CEO can say more about that. Okay. CEO, you want to come and tell us? <laughs> 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 so, it's starting from Accra. Yes. Not Okay. So, from Accra That's, to Togo. Let him give you more okay. explanation. So, because I'm trying to understand. So, it's going to be a walk. So, this is going to be with fans or it's just her? Right. No. So, basically, she, I know she stated... Um, Accra, mm. we're actually starting from the border of Ivory Coast in Ghana okay. oh. and walking all the way to Aflo, to uh, the border of uh, Ghana and Togo. Okay. Um, and we'll be stopping at various towns. So basically what we want to try and achieve is doing like 20 miles a, a day. Mm. So for, for, for every town that we stop at, um, she does a show, she does a meet and greet, then she performs. Okay. Then the following morning, we move to the next, to the next. So we're looking at um, you know, different places. Okay. 
uh, Cape Coast, uh, Buzia. Mm -hmm. You know, by the time we hit Accra, then it's, it's going to be live. Okay, all right. <laughs> yeah, then, okay. you know, then we carry on. You know, we'll do um, uh, Pram Pram, mm -hmm. Keta, yeah. and, all and, the and way until to... we get, then we'll do a final big show when we get to our flower. Wow, sounds really good. And so if I want to be a, a part of it, let's say on your socials, what would be your handle somebody can reach you on? Abitemi, A-B-I-T-E-M-I. Mm. -E mm. And you can also email the label, that's Shantoma Music, that's okay. C-H-O-M-A-T-O-N-A. Okay. No. Sh Shantoma. <laughs> I'm confused, bro. T-O-M-A, right? Yeah. Okay. Yes, T-O-M-A. Right. Okay. At gmail.com. So right. Gmail.com. Okay. Okay. So, yeah. But it's so. even uh, available on my, um, on by, in my bio. Okay. So, you just go on my Instagram or mm. any other media. Yeah. All so right. Sh yeah. So, Shantoma is uh, actually spelled C-H-O-T-A-M-A. -A. So, it's shantomamusicgroup.com. Okay. All right. So, there you go. And... Uh, um, do you have any link with David Bolton? How did you know? David is the one who mixed, who actually mixed and mastered oh, yeah. the song. So when when we record, we record, we wait, record wait, wait, at wait, Prime. Wait, 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 David proof. mixed and yeah. mastered the song. He's yeah. the, he's mixing the whole album. You know, he's one of the best, right? Yeah. Of course. I mean, we only work with the best. I mean, the reality is this: like we've we've had a long, a very very long relationship. Mm. You know, we've been good friends for a while, um, but also you know we respect each other's art, yes. art form so mm -hmm. with with me you know when i first moved to ghana to even do the music thing you know i set up a recording studio in jolu and at the time i was um i had um, a producer that mm. i was training well he was in training at the time like guilty beats okay. so he was with me for a while um and even with that i was doing some production mm -hmm. but then i pulled back to say you know what let me just focus on the label side yes. of stuff let, let the young ones do what they do mm -hmm. then I'll just support from, from the back yeah. um, so that's how it's kind of thing so with, with that situation it's easier to you know let the art form do what the art form should do mm -hmm. and those of us that can run business let's you just let's just do it do yeah it. so wow. Prime yeah Prime Media they 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 that's where we record mm -hmm. that's where we do our production um and yeah they're great david bolton is a good he's a great guy well david bolton is an amazing guy he's uh he comes here every now and then he's like um so i'm not surprised with what he's done because mm -hmm. i was telling bradash that the sound is different everything is different yeah. little did i know he's a Ghanaian who did it so yes. um you all out there david bolton yeah you've been listening to him on hits fm <laughs> when he comes in he seems to know a lot more about music as well so yes Definitely. every time those conversation yeah. comes up he's always able to enlighten us and also give us more information about it so it's Definitely. good you're working with then your family oh definitely you're all family then because <laughs> david is family yeah. No, it's it's so good to have you two here, and I hope it doesn't end here because Amen. now that we've started this family, let's just continue. I'm yeah. all about women, so forgive me. I'm I'm just yeah. pushing the agenda of women. I like so, it. Listen, I I love it. Like I yeah. said, for um for me, you know, growing up in the UK, I see um so many women do things that men do as well mm. so you know you see women doing plumbing electric you know electricians <laughs> I know, right? you know um i remember in in um in florida we went on a cruise and i met uh, a female crane operator so she's up in the mm. sky you know <laughs> doing wow. things that are primarily you know a man, would do. A, a man will do and i love to see women challenging the norm mm. you know because unfortunately that the society we live in Everything is male dominated, <laughs> dominated, yes, you know. It is. And um, I think the space is slowly changing because opportunities should be available for everybody. Exactly. Wow. Thank you so much. And just like you said, social media is a bit of me, right? Yes. Yes. And please make sure you come by every now and then when you release music. Me, I said, come, sure. come. So just come by. Is there anything you'd like to say before wrap yeah, up? I'd like to give a shout out to Gas Clothing. He's mm. in the UK. He's the one that helps me. Um, Provides my hoodie, my, mm -hmm. my, what again? Apparel, yeah. yeah apparel. My, all my apparels. Okay. And also, Olala Salon. Mm. They are the one Do that, your head. you know, Very my beautiful. Hair and my nails, you understand? Mm -hmm. They keep me nice every day, uh, every every week, yeah. Okay. So, right. And also, shout out to Shantoma Music. All right. Group. Mm. And I'm glad where I am right now is different from where I was like two years ago. I like, know, right? Mentally, mm -hmm. financially. Mm. You no, know, everything spiritual, everything it has just changed, and I feel like everything is just time. 
Mm. Yes. All right. Thank you so much. And I want you to know out there that is doable. You can do it. Somebody has done it. You can also do it. Yes. Thank you so much, Abitemi, for coming through. And all the best. Thank you. Something you found, something you're doing, just keep doing, keep pushing. And I believe Thank that uh, one day I'll just stand somewhere and go like, hey, and you just say, yeah. And I'll say, yeah. <laughs> come on stage. Yeah. I'll come and dance for you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for coming through. Thank so you for that's me. the brand new one. She calls this one Kana right here on Daybreak Hits. This is Pits.